what's going on youtube world i'm that dude named dave and i am back with another reaction video but before i get started hey let's just do some quick house cleaning here click on like and subscribe and that bell notification below why i'm gonna say it again till we get there struggle stream nation i'm brand new on youtube as you can see here i need the youtube algorithm so i'm gonna give you guys a few seconds to do that a few seconds didn't want to take you much time here so you saw the title you clicked on that thumbnail it's another Kevin Samuels reaction video here. I don't need to go any more detail. Let's get straight to the video. Disagreement. Okay, what and is it? The disagreement is, is that I believe, you know, I've been watching your show for a while. You're my guilty pleasure. And uh -huh. I feel like you break down women a lot. Uh-oh. And it's it's needed. It's break down women. Stuff. Break down women. What does it's that break mean? down the whole that way they move, the way they think, the way that they talk, how they handle men, how they handle you on the show, all of those things, and break it oh. down. And I just feel like there's not building up. There's no. What? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Am I a therapist? No, but you're a coach, your life coach, right? And yeah, you pay for that service. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You pay for that service. Absolutely, but I feel like there should be some kind of social responsibility as an influencer. To Whoa. So she says guilty pleasure. She likes to watch him, but she thinks that he should be held to a higher standard. He should be doing more, but he's someone on YouTube who hosts a show. And then on top of that, if you want additional search, you have to pay for that. That's what he was saying. He's a coach. You got to pay for that. No one's paying here. You're watching free on YouTube. So Okay, let's get back to the video because this is already starting off on a bad note here for him, for her. Hold on, wait a wait a damn minute, up. wait a damn minute. Hold on, I got a serious question. Do you hold Steve Harvey and all these people equally responsible for the lack of criticism? Good question. Absolutely. The, really? The feelings are all mutual, especially people who have a platform. And I really, like you, I'm not saying you have to be free 99 about it, but just what? a little bit of nuggets. Of oh, so, so, so you, so what you're trying to basically get us to believe is I never offer anything constructive. I, I don't do any of that. It's all just tearing folks down. That's all it is. Right. That's what we got to get here in this video here. And Kevin's going to break this down. People think when they see these clips here, like he just breaks like she breaks down women or he's just beating them up and tell them that you're not good enough. But is he giving harsh, constructive criticism? Is there something valuable what he gives here? Yes, there may be some things that the tones are harsh, but is he offering valuable information in the discussions here? Let's get back to the clip. No, we're not into generalizations. Remember? Well, well, you gotta because because I'm not listening. I'm not hearing what you're saying, so I'm trying to understand you, what I don't build people up. I don't give them actionable information to follow up on. I I don't think it's enough. No, I think it's, I think it's enough. Enough. Little, little, wow. enough. I think it's a dribble. Uh, enough. To Are you out? Uh, okay, man. Mm -hmm. Do you hold? any of the daytime talk shows that have existed for my lifetime mm -hmm. such the standard good question that the shows on today like the view the real other shows in the past that may have came on that the major network t uh, television programs network t tv affiliates they have spread a lot of propaganda bad things in relationships throughout the decades so ladies, are you holding them accountable right now? Are the current shows that's getting bad information? Do you hold these women's feet to the fire? Oh boy, let's get back to the clip. To be, no, 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 you don't. What do you mean? So you expect for someone to sit down and give someone a balanced, thorough analysis on a live call-in advice show. Make it make sense. Not necessarily, but you, it, it can be- No, it's either you do or form. you don't, because you cannot tell me that you have not seen me sit down and t hell, the average at best video. How long did that, how long did that original video last? 
it was two hours and it was no the the average of best segment when i talked to that one lady how long did that last i'm sorry it was lengthy i watched it and um how long so was about it? how long about how long it was it was an hour what no it for her for her it was it was 22 minutes it was okay oh i'm talking about the whole show okay just for i her. said yeah i i went back and said the the average of best video mm-hmm. uh-huh and, and in so, that okay. and in that video in that video of the 22 minutes, how many times did I offer constructive advice? Now, is she going to say that he doesn't? Because if Kevin did get any advice, he would not be as big as he is. Now, we know that there's platforms on YouTube where people are just going crazy. They say certain things, you know, and, and people get that shock value. But you don't get to this status here without giving the good with the bad. You know, you give a little bit of entertainment, but there is that medicine involved here as well. So let's see what she says. Let's get back to the clip. Honestly, it was just, here's the thing. Uh -uh. Before you move, before they hear the, nope. Hey, see, before Kevin, see, men, look at this here. Whenever we're in a conversation with anybody, especially women, and you ask a direct question and they start to speak, and then they're like, well, let me, no, 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 no. Do not move the goalposts. We're not changing the subject here. We need you to answer my direct question. Then we can move on. There might be some follow-up questions here, but you know what happens when someone does this here? You're going to lose your train of thought of this particular moment and this particular idea here. Stay on course. Stay on course. Do not move the goalposts. Before here's the thing, because see, when you guys come up here and say I do something, you're going to have to stand on this shit. Mm -hmm. I'm standing. No, no, you're not. Not, no, you're not. You're not standing too well. No, How many thing. times did I offer constructive, actionable advice? I, I did. I would say that you did. You have, it's been so while since I've watched it. It's been Answer a the question. Now. You just had the year anniversary video. So uh -huh. let, me, let, so, me, uh -huh. let me use my encyclopedia of mine and go back. And there well, if you're going to say I don't offer something, I'm, I'm expecting you to be able to point to something because I know what I do. And you're but just not right. I just feel like the rhetoric is not. Oh. And exactly. We know what we say, fellas. Stand on your on what your ground is. If someone tries to call you out, pull their card. Get the exact information. You just can't say, oh, I feel this way. I think this way. No. What exactly did I say? What exactly do I do that you're that you're upset at me about? Or whatever that scenario is. Hold them accountable. You just can't throw something blanket because of the feeling you had. And I may not be the one that's involved in those feelings here. You might have the misconception of me because feelings can mean can be so many different things here. Facts. That's what we're going to stand on here. Let's get back to the clip. I feel, 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 feel. Okay. Uh -huh. I believe. Uh -huh. I hear. You see that? I hear from the show. I believe. I hear. I believe. Is the rhetoric is, uh -huh. is more, you know, um, it's more you got to do this, but instead of this is how you do it. So the rhetoric is more like boom in your face, foul shot. Ma'am, hold on. I'm, a, I'm trying to be. I'm trying to be as polite as possible. I need you to speak like people don't know who you are. Right. Because okay. what you're saying makes no sense. Boom, pow. So I feel like the boom and the pow is, is that, okay, let's go back to the average of best. Yes. So she had to have a realization like, ma'am, you're not a eight, nine, 10. You're not a Kelly, Beyonce, and a, a Rihanna. How many, did, did I? How many people in this world is really Kelly, Beyonce, or Rihanna? Even Rihanna is pregnant. It's nine, it's 99% of the women can't touch her women realistic expectations how many of you are really in this category back to the clip offer any actionable practical real world advice in a 22 minute interaction i want to say yes i can't remember exactly you want to say was. yes get rid of the dog this is what i'm showing you guys most of my critics are disingenuous most of my critics are not honest critics I offered that woman to go to therapy 11 different times. Wow. For the, no, ma'am, for the first, no, 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 no. Oh, let me pause. He gave, in a 22 minute video, he gave someone therapy 11 times. 
and we know the context of how he talks about therapy if you do follow that content this content here if you don't you can go check it out but you can't say he doesn't do enough when he said you need to go to therapy and then said that 11 times and then in the context of breaking down what therapy can do for that woman let's get back to the clip don't over but if, no 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 okay so no no you can't oh no hold on you, no, hold on See, what this is, is about feelings. Mm. Feelings over facts. It's all about a feeling. I feel you should do this. I feel you should do that. I need to be Gandhi up in this bitch. But yet you got people selling y'all, buy, act like a man, think like a woman, and lying to you. And y'all don't sit around and hold anybody else to such a standard. But then I'm supposed to sit down and talk to a complete stranger and give an in-depth coaching session get the french toast out of here on that notion i'm gonna stop the video here kevin is right here there are so many people throughout years that we have not held accountable and especially in our own community steve harvey made a boatload of movie off the of think like a man series the movies the books giving bad total false advice to women thinking about what what men you know what we can give to a woman and what the standards are and we see how that's put women to a bad state here and, and no one holds steve harvey accountable he's a funny guy i like his comedy but what was the accountability he's got more jobs he's you know he's got a, he's a judge he got family few going on he does so many things radio he's there's no accountability it's like nah steve you were wrong here you need to we don't see that here but with kevin samuels oh boy you need to do more you, there should be extra you should do in here offers therapy no you need to do a little bit more than that let's make it make sense here comment like subscribe click on that bell notification below and shout out to the day ones here because this is a new channel on youtube here and i'm loving all the information call my card or show me love whatever the case it be i love it all but until next time i am that dude named dave and i'm out of here see you guys later